This is Bob Barr bringing you another edition of Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe, Law Number One, The World is Full of Idiots. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and to follow Liberty Guard on social media. In coming up with our Idiot of the Week here, reflecting Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe, Law Number One, the world is full of idiots, I had a little difficulty. Not that what we're going to be talking about is not idiotic, it is, but who is the idiot here? And I think looking at this, the idiot is American society, American and Western society also, but let's focus on American society and children in particular and parents. When I was growing up and granted, I grew up overseas by and large in different countries, but even when I was you know, in first, second and third grade uh, here in, in the United States, I had a great deal of freedom in what my parents allowed me to do as a kid. They taught me, you know, basic common sense rules. Don't stick your hand into a light socket. Don't put your hand in a, in a hot boiling pan of water. You know, don't pull the da- tail of a dog that you don't know. I mean, common sense rules. Don't get in a car with strangers. That helped give me the basic tools and the outlook to survive as a child. Probably almost all of you with us today felt the same way. You know, you had a great deal of freedom and that's how you learn to deal with the world. It's learned how you learn how to protect yourself, to stay out of danger, to get out of problems when you get into it. And yet today, you know, you look at, for example, the 911 calls that people, uh, that people make. 911 calls to because they see a child on the sidewalk outside of their house. Parents and society in general has become so coddling of children and so oppressively oppressive of children that we're losing something very important in our children, the ability to think and do things for themselves and to explore the great world around them. And this is why it's become necessary, for example, as idiotic as it is, it has become necessary for state legislatures to consider and pass legislation that says it's okay for kids to play outside. It's not illegal to let your kid walk home from school. Colorado, for example, Colorado, the House legislature, Uh, Actually, it was a a committee of the House legislature in Colorado recently passed a bill, 13 to nothing, surprise, that says it's okay to let your children play outside. There are all sorts of examples of this. There was a book written uh, recently, The Coddling of the the American Mind, that that talks about this. Uh, And other examples that you can find where parents get in serious trouble for letting their child walk home from school or to play outside for a period of time. This is nonsense. It's idiotic. It's hurting our children, particularly in the age of COVID, where many parents still are afraid to let their children do anything without a cockamamie mask on. This has to stop. It shouldn't be necessary for Colorado or any other state to pass a law that says it's okay to let your children play outside. But we've reached the stage where it apparently is necessary. So support this sort of stuff, but be reasonable. Demand that parents not get in trouble for letting their children do what children need to do. And that is to be children, to have freedom, within bounds, but to have freedom to grow and nurture and discover the wonderful world around them. Don't let them be stifled the way society is now doing to our children. That's uh, their Idiot of the Week, American Society and the Oppressive Coddling of Children. I hope you'll be with us next week for yet another edition of Liberty Guards, Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe, Law Number One, The World is Full of Idiots. Thanks for being with us.
This is Bob Barr, and I'd like to thank you for having checked out our program here today, Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe. We appreciate your support, your participation, and encourage you to go to libertyguard.org to learn more about our programs and also to help support to further individual freedom and fight against government abuse. One of the ways, but not the only way we do this is through Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe, but through many, many other programs in support of individual liberty and against government abuse. So please remember to join us, go to libertyguard.org and join us once again for Bob Barr's Laws of the Universe. Thank you. My name is Matt Strickland, Liberty Guard saved my family business. I spent most of my adult life fighting for my country overseas. When I came home, I became a small business owner and sadly realized that nobody would fight for me. Our state and local government were trying to shut my family business down for good. And that's when I found Liberty Guard. With Liberty Guard's help, we won the battle against government overreach. And now my business is thriving and growing faster than ever. Stand with Matt and others just like you in the fight against government overreach. Join Liberty Guard today.